Welcome back to Command and Conquer All Stars. This time we're gonna play as the get a get a writer here. The generals elite. And those those guys feel more like just a general's faction. So yeah, this this feels a bit odd after seeing the Tiberium and the Red Alert Universe stuff that has been ported. Yes, we got a cold fusion reactor for that. But we're almost there. Here we go. Once more we have an AI mate here. But this time... We actually have the edge here we could collect from here a little bit easier. But this time we're at opposite ends of the map, so we have to defend ourselves in both directions. Let's get a second one here. I guess the same rules still apply. Upgrade you here. And no, we do not have. Let's maybe get like one, one Patriot here. Because you can't just spam stuff willy nilly. Uh, let's get one of you going here as well. It's not much, but we'll, we'll go with that. And sure, a little more power here. How expensive are you actually? Yeah, a thousand credits still. Let's go with the United States of America. Cash bounty, that could be useful considering that cash is a little bit harder to obtain here. So these guys here are going for. You know what? Maybe I should go for a second supply depot here. And also should have forwarded my stuff here a little bit better, but well. Well, I didn't, did I? What's the mission, sir? GLA and United States working hand in hand here. Because you're still vulnerable to, to air units, but I guess we should we should actually build our defenses here, shouldn't we? Yes, we definitely should. Ooh, could be too late. No, I think it's too late here. Yeah. Okay, so you have to take out that that tank there, and then we can forward you. Oh snap! They are in peril. In fact, our homes just just disappeared. I should have hit in this tent here. In fact, what this guy is almost dead. On the other hand. Build that here. Then let's get sure. Let's get you in here. Also two of you here, and let's get another reactor here. You can attack that. You're not dealing that much damage against. In here with you, and also a patriot here. We got the ourselves grenaded here. I can live with that. We should probably get some. You know what? Let's maybe go with the That's a good war choice. factory here. Yes. You here should also need a, a friend here. And we may need, may need another one of you here too. Okay. This should make things a little bit easier. Here are some encounters, but nothing too threatening. Okay. Let's get another, another barracks here. We can do that. Another Chinese barracks, of course. One more view here as well. At least we've got American auto repair here. More infantry coming. Uh, do we have snipers or so? But terrorists. I'm not sure how good that is. Oh, they're garrisoning this. Oh, I don't like that. Oh, snap. That's not good. Uh, let's see. Can I get one or two of you here going? Who knows? We'll see. The mission is to garrison yourself here. Oh wow, that dealt quite some damage actually. So what helicopters do we have here? Because, of the, yeah, these folks here. Sure, bunch of those. Maybe we should also get like, you know, a war factory. Could be useful. Uh, and maybe another reactor here. Yet another reactor, that is. Okay, you fixed me that. Well done, you. Don't have propaganda towers, that's unfortunate. Uh, excellent. So what upgrades do you have? I guess we need a tech center for that. Well, let's see. So you're already getting your upgrade here. And then let's maybe get the strategy center going. And do we have overlords? Uh, we do have overlords, well, theoretically. So you need to fix some of my stuff here. 
we should also just get more grizzlies in there. Yes, oh snap. They've got a v V2 rockets here, okay. We get out of there. Ah, oh, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Yeah, it's gonna hurt. Well, you're also gonna hurt us. Uh, me destroying your, in your base with his in inadequate base uh, defenses here. Okay, then let's get a uh, strategy center. I don't know. Oh, do we have that? Like theoretically. Okay, you get in here. Uh, yes. And maybe also an internet center. As soon as I can afford one of those. What do you think you're doing here? You kill that guy, please. Yeah, these guys are kind of vulnerable to what we have here. Yeah, they don't really have much in the way of anti air here, do they? No, they really do not. You know what? I don't like your face. Oh snap, now they do have anti air. Get out of there. Let's maybe kill one of their reactors here. Let's make life a little harder. Then again, they do have. They do have the, the nuclear reactor already. So I'm not sure how much of a difference that's gonna make, actually. In any case. Internet center, please. Fly lines. And sure, super weapon. Oh snap. Okay, you get out of here. And maybe get yourself fixed. And definitely want an overlord tank here. So, cash bounty. Yes, I think I want that. Weapon and side range. Always happy to get that. Yes, sir. Okay, okay, sure. Very nice. Oh yeah, hackers. Forgot those exist. We have eight, eight spots here. Eight hackers in here. Can we build multiple of these? Uh, we cannot. But let's build another power plant here. And let's also upgrade you here. Here we go. Let's you get a Gatling tower here. And then we're also going to get one with a Are you gonna come through here, are you mostly? With propaganda tower. Yes. Because the general tunes are a little bit less interesting because I'm not really that curious about the implementation. Aerial defense countermeasures installed. Yeah, okay. The nice thing is we get the best super weapon. You're more choppers. You helped me out here a little bit. I really wish we had propaganda towers, but I guess we could get we could get uh, propaganda overlord over here. Yeah, let's maybe do that. Once we have a little more money here. That should do it. Super weapon here is ready as well. Yeah, they don't stand a chance here. Yeah, I was thinking the general's faction is really, uh, really a little bit too competitive here. We have some downsides, such as not being able to build multiple things at once, as long as we don't have multiple dozers and everything. But I think that's a feeling overall, don't really have that many downsides. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna talk for you as well. Uh, can that even be destroyed? I'm not so sure. Doesn't seem to take any damage. Yeah, is that immune to whatever weapon these guys are using? Possibly. That would be uh, rather annoying. But let's see. Sure, so... Where do we actually get this upgrade here? Is that just in the war factory? No, it doesn't seem to be like it. Okay, you get in here. What have we not built? Oh, we have... Oh, well, not tunnel network. Sure, let's get one of those. For completeness sake. Well, that's quite a lot of you here. Guess you could also join us here. Nice. Sure, more cash. Fuel bomb here, why not? Almost drop that on this guy here. Can we fuel this? Because this is really distracting our ally here. Not that it matters all that much, but it does matter a little bit. 
Let's see. I think I don't want you to have more air units. Oh snap, they have get elite Gatling tank. Yeah, we're not gonna do that. We may just need more overlord tanks here, to be honest. Yeah, sure, let's get a couple of them over here. We're also the only person with a super weapon at this specific point in time. And wow, do we have a lot of money. Build another war factory here. We could also get some planes, maybe. Sure. A couple of you here. Yeah, this is just invincible. That's a bit unfortunate, because that's a major distraction for our ally here. Question is, do you... Oh, snap, they can attack helicopters. Forgot about that. But I can also destroy their airfields. I don't know why I worded that like as if that was a comeback or so. Anyway, get yourself fixed here. Yeah, there's definitely an issue here. With these being basically indestructible, but sure, doesn't matter that much, does it? These guys here are basically finished. Do you have any super weapon that I can throw at them here? Not really. I should have attacked them here, but as soon as I have all these overlords here ready, we can just we can just accumulate them here. Let's get some palants as well, and these guys here. Because why not? Then I don't have any money anymore, but it's fine because I don't really need that much here, do I? But I should get the rest of my Chinese hackers in here. Here we go. I guess no, I can build more, but I can't. Maybe one more propaganda lot? Sure, wait a second, do I? Already got this one here, never mind. There we go, you, you'll be another propaganda lot. And then let's have you here as backup. Sure. First destroy... Ooh, hello. First destroy you here. Come over here. Yeah, all the soft stuff they have here. Yeah, none of these guys here can even remotely threat my overlords. They're just not a credible threat. Okay, in that case... So an APC. I guess that's a mine layer, so an APC. A Scudstorm here as well. But that still needs a moment to be charged up. We've got more Comanches. Oh, we know they're longbows for them. And yeah, you collect collect that cash. Thank you for destroying that mine layer before it lays any mines. You come over here, you can destroy the slave mine or whatnot. Lots of conscripts, but I think these just stem from destroyed structures. So, uh, carpet bombing, yes, sure. And stealth here, sure. Stealth overlords. Not that it's particularly necessary at this stage here, but yeah, you can carpet bomb you here. There we go. And then we can also use a scud sub on top of that. Let's see how you like that. You maybe take a little bit of a step back here. There we go. This should, this should seal the deal. You're less than 50 minutes in. Yeah. I have the feeling that at least in the in the hands of... Like against the AI and in the hands of the AI, the, the general's faction is definitely a superior one. There's so much good stuff. The overlords alone, I would say they are maybe overall better than Apocalypse tanks because survivability is so high. Yes, yeah, so just a number of uh, advantages. Let's see. Oh snap, they have anti air there, but let's see if we can take revenge on the Harriers. Not quite. We would actually build more Tesla cores there. Well, we do have an air fleet here now, so let's destroy you here straight away. Or oh, someone should clear it out. Maybe that those cleared out with flashbangs or so? Who knows? Who knows? I don't. Okay, joint assault here. We're moving. Then we can wrap this up. Oh, this pilot here. Pilot of the USA. Sure. Protecting you go into this Chinese tank here. Doing what's right. Radar won't pick us up. Okay. Is there a threat? Enemies of the free world. Here we are. Someone destroy these grenadiers here. The right thing to do. We fight for peace. 
and someone destroy that nuclear reactor too. Even though well that's basically already there. Here we go. Nice. There's some defenses here, but well those those are offline I'm afraid. You defend this portion of the map, please. And here we go. We are victorious. Yep, that wasn't really much of a problem. But I think there's just a lot of good stuff that the general's faction has, such as the bunkers with like five rock guys inside. Of course, it does cost you some money, five rock guys plus bunker costs something like, I think just under 2,000 credits, but it's such a strong defense. Like just having an overlord's great with regeneration and everything. So yeah, and let's see what we do next time. Thanks for watching and take care.